Hello, all you Wookiees. How's it going? Coming back at you guys with another boss guide for Neo. Today, we will be fighting Saika Makoichi, or as I like to just refer to him as Makoichi Saika, because I first remembered the name from Onimusha 2. Um, it's actually a pretty fun fight, very interesting. Um, and I'm going to go over what you guys need to do to defeat him and what you guys need to do to prepare. So right off the bat, uh, Michael, Michaelichi Saika, um, or I'm just going to say Makoichi. Um, he, um, sorry, I'm getting distracted because my dog's playing around right now. Um, He's kind of weaker to like wind and lightning, so I actually have uh, the Rurikiri on right now. Or also, I've usually always used the Rurikiri, so lightning is, prob is probably best for this fight. Um, I also have my double washi on because we're going to be doing kind of a little cheese for you guys. Um, he does mostly bullet attacks. He doesn't really use um, any swiping attacks unless you're really close to him. Um, I think it's like about half health, I, I want to say. He actually shows his guardian spirit. In which case, he actually changes up his attack, power, attack a little bit. Um... He'll actually start flying up into the air because he'll actually be able to fly. I know, it sucks that he gets to fly, we don't. Um, anyway, he'll actually use bombs as well. Uh, if he actually hits you, he'll fly at you. If he hits you, that's usually him grabbing you and then slamming you to the ground hard. And that's usually going to kill most of you guys. Uh, probably even kill me. Um... So, the things to work out for, really, in this fight are his... Just kind of keep on par. Just make sure you avoid his gun attack the best you can. Um, what you really want to look out for is when he does his flying attack and when he does his... Um, his bombs attack. Uh, you guys will see what I'm talking about when I get to the inside the boss fight. Um, it's actually one of my favorite... Uh, I would say one of my favorite NPC fights. Um, not to mention his armor is actually pretty cool. Um, I think that's pretty much it. It's been a while since I've fought this guy, so I may not remember all of his moves. But he, I think he does use a... I think it's more like a, a Tonto or a Katana, but he doesn't use it, as I feel, as often as his guns and his bombs. So what I will end up doing is I'll usually use Prokosov, and when he's not up on the floor, like up on the ground, the, up on his wings, you can actually use your Guardian Spirit Dabawashi to knock him up in the air and slam him back down and you can get a f uh, finisher on him, I believe. So, let's go ahead and get into it. Nope, never mind. He does the wings right off the bat. Never mind. I thought it was half health, but no. So, a few corrections. Um, as you saw, I did... I kind of double press, but it's a good sh the show for you guys. When he's up in the air, he can't hurt you. 
or you shouldn't say can't hurt you. You can't parry him with the double washi. It actually increased my capacity a little bit. Let me see if I can get more. No. So this is the best I'm going to be able to do. Um, if you've played through this level, guys, I, I highly recommend that you guys get a the shortcut I'm going to show you. Which is this right, right here. It takes you pretty much right to the boss fight. Personally, this is like one of my least favorite bot places to be because of all the, the enemies I have to go through, um, all the fire that you have to deal with. And once you, um, once you, I've already beat the yokai in here, so you just have to run past all this. Just go like this, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Watch out for that. And you're at the boss fight again. So you see it, when he's up in the air, you can't hit him. See what I'm saying is, he mostly uses bombs. Lost my lock on. But yeah, kind of be careful of that. Sometimes if he summons his guardian spirit, boom, 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 boom. Ooh, I got some of his armor too. Let me go ahead and lock that in place. I don't want to sell that. It's actually pretty good armor. I got two pieces of his armor. Oh! I can't believe I went through the whole level with my Kadama ball. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. So, um, as you guys saw, he does have a katana, so if you go close combat to him, he will use it, but the things like I like I said, you just really want to look out for his so his gunfire, bombs. Um, I highly highly recommend using um, sloth because it just makes the boss fights a lot easier, especially when it comes to him because he's a very fast hitting character. 
Um, the one thing I didn't show is when he kind of glides at you, he'll grab you and slam you down. And that's usually a one-hit kill. Or gets you, like, half health or close to death. Um, like, my first attempt, like, this kind of got greedy. And I was spamming my uh, Guardian Spirit summon. But... Um... Um, and that's kind of what happened. Now, one of the cool things about this fight is also, if you manage, if you manage to get him to the point where he actually just backs up into the fire, he'll actually take on fire damage. So you can use this like, area to your advantage. But uh, that's pretty much the boss fight, guys. Um, let me know if you found this this video helpful, informative. I know this game has been out there for a while. I know there's probably a billion freaking boss guys out there, but I thought I, I need I want to start somewhere. I'd like to start doing walkthroughs and guides as a part of part of my channel, uh, but I need to get used to doing them. I need to. So I thought I'd start with the game again that I would that I know very well fairly well and that I can talk you guys through it. Uh, if you guys have any, any, I please, please, if you guys have any games you guys would like me to do a boss guide on, or you guys would like me to try to walk through, uh, please let those, me hear those suggestions in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to rate this video uh, if you liked it. I'd like to know, also put that in the comment section below why you guys liked it. What am I doing right? Um, if you guys put a thumbs down, please let me know in the comment section why I got a thumbs down and what I can do to improve that. Um, also, if you're new to this channel, um, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Um, all those, all these things help out the channel greatly. I get a, I'm, I'll give content out to you guys on a regular basis. Hope you guys are all having a wookie tastic day, and I'll see you all on our next adventure. Till next time, see ya.